This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. That crust out your eyes. Well played. What do you got? It's not. Sway in the morning. Shade 4 5. That's a clip <laughs> from Franklin and Bash. <laughs> They're fighting. They're fighting. Right They're now. fighting right now, man. Uh -huh. <laughs> this is what they do on air, too. Uh -huh. He's fucking with my levels. All right. Mark Paul Gossler, what up, man? How you doing, brother? I'm feeling good. Feeling, feeling good. good. If this guy would stop fucking with my levels, That's knock it off. Breck and Meyer turn right there. Up. Turn me up. That's turn right. him down. Yeah, I'm done with you. Spit a freestyle. Spit a freestyle. <laughs> Whoa, who's rapping? Somebody's <laughs> rapping? Breck I, didn't Breck I didn't do anything. My album drops in October, guys. Yeah. What's your first single? I can't even really talk about it. It's called How Do I Love You. <laughs> uh, featuring Swiss Beats. <laughs> so featuring Swiss Beats. <laughs> <laughs> Breck and Meyer, man. It's good to see you, man. Good uh, to see you. Uh, man, uh, yeah, you were, I'm from Cali, man. So you. There you go. You, Where in uh, California? I'm from Oakland. Okay. Yeah. Uh, right. My dad's in the Bay Area. Your dad's from My Oakland? father's up there. Well, what, no, he lives there now. You don't want to get a city? No. no. Okay. He's a, he's a wanted man. He's in the witness <laughs> he's in the program. program. <laughs> I can't even really talk about it. Yeah, yo, yo, but man, you guys, man, you guys, you look great, man. You know, you guys been in the business for a long time. You haven't let it ruin your skin or nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? We moisturize. Yeah, you moisturize, yeah, moisturize each, each other. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Mark, Mark Paul, man, it's good to see you, bro. You, man. Yeah, man, lady, ladies, when I told, when I mentioned you were coming, man, no offense, Breck. Breck yeah, I'll, and, I'll just and, go and, fuck okay, myself. Yeah, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I'll be no. over here. Oh, go lady, ahead. A lot of ladies start no, go calling on, Sway, up. Go on, no, go ahead, go on Sway. Sway. Go ahead, Sway. Go ahead. A lot of ladies start calling up early. We mentioned yeah. it like hours ago. It's like, wait, well, hold up. You won't be here till the end of the show. Hold up. You know, and, uh, um, you, <laughs> okay. you, you still dealing with that? Yeah. Doing, uh, Are you still dealing with being yeah. attractive? Is that, yeah. How's that working out for you, Mark Paul? Yeah. Look at this. Look at is that. it good being attractive? That sounds how, how is it when you walk around the street and you know you just can't <laughs> take a footstep without people just jumping all over you? Is it weird? Is it weird <laughs> having a woman constantly attached to your penis? I'm just curious. <laughs> <laughs> is it weird? I want to know too. Does it bother you? <laughs> <laughs> Freaking going through it. But you don't get the, you don't you don't get that kind of attention. I'm adorable, Sway. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm offbeat and adorable. Okay. All right? Yeah, are you in a relationship? <laughs> are you married or anything? Yes. Brecken? Yeah, he is. I yes, am. he is. Yes. yes, yes. That's why I wasn't going to answer that last question. Yes, yes, <laughs> happily, happily. And man. she loves J forty five. Let's talk about your failures, Brecken. <laughs> All right, <laughs> shall we? <laughs> Garfield too. No, let's talk about your relationship failures. Let's Go ahead. Are you in a relationship right now? Things are good. Things are really good. I'm feeling really healthy. Um, I'm getting a lot of time with me. He's and, adorable. And that's important. Hashtag blessed. <laughs> no. That's what my album's called. Hashtag, Hashtag blessed. blessed. It drops in October, guys. Yo, man, how do y'all even get work done on a set when it seems like you guys are such good friends? Do, do you get work done? We actually surprisingly do. We're, yeah. actually, we're, we're pretty professional when it comes to doing our job, but we do fuck around a lot. Yeah. Uh, but not when it comes to the work. Not when, yep. we, uh, not when, we're, when the light is on, mm -hmm. as they like to say in the business. Right? They say that stuff. Nope. The nope. They don't say that? <laughs> yeah, I say that. Nobody ever has. I say that. You say that? Um, but uh, yeah, we, we, we get the shit done. We get the shit done, right? Uh, Franklin and Bash, man, uh, this is like season four mm -hmm. already, right? And yeah. Um, Man, if a, if a series go past half a season nowadays, oh you, you kind of consider lucky, you know. Yeah. So TNT been very supportive of this, right? They've been good. Yeah. They've been good. They've been behind us. I mean, no, it's four years running, and uh, yeah, things are pretty good. We're excited about this one. This is going to be a good season. Yeah. We weren't too happy with the outcome of season three, only from a personal level. Okay. Probably the audience wouldn't notice it, but it was one of those things where we like when these characters have their backs against the wall and they yeah. kind of become the underdogs. And we felt in the third season, we became the man. Mm -hmm. We weren't fighting for, uh, yeah. we weren't fighting against the man. So this year's, uh, this year we're kind of going back to our roots. Fighting and, against uh, the man. Fighting against the man. I've been doing that all my life, man. Fighting <laughs> against the man. Preach. You know what I mean? <laughs> Breaking. You know, just when you try to come up, yep, the man brings you down, That's man. My, it's it's basically the title of my book. <laughs> <laughs> just when you come up, just the, when you come up, the, the man, man brings you down. down. Okay, yep. man. Uh, look, I want to open up the phone lines. Uh, Mark Paul Gosler is here. Breck and Meyer, they're both here. Franklin and Bash are here. Uh, you want to talk with them? Eight 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 seven four two three three four five. Breck and Meyer, join me with this, man. Everybody, you can, you can tell everybody. most people. <laughs> Go ahead and tell most people I'm the man I'm the man I have a penis that means I'm a man Yeah
Anatomically, I'm a man. 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 That is. Wait, man. Let's, let's harmonize. Man. man. I like that, man. That's a, yo, that's Good a remix. Cool. Like Franklin and Bass are here. Uh, the season four premiere is, take, is today Tuesday or Wednesday? Today's Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Next, so to, next Wednesday. Next Wednesday. Right? Next Wednesday. The season premiere, of, well, season four premiere is happening. And what's going to happen in this? What can you tell us without giving it all up? Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Mike okay. Tyson and I yeah. get in a fight. Okay. All right. Yep. That's exciting. Um, Mark Paul directs his first episode of television this season. Oh, uh, that's your first time directing? Brecken writes my, dir- my uh, directorial debut. Is this true? Yep. Yeah. Okay. I, I, it's written by Frank and Beans. Written by Franklin and Bash. Uh huh. That episode. Um. This uh, this season is we're, zombies. We got some zombies. Okay. Strippers. Hey. Strippers. Zombies, strippers, and Mark Paul. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, this season we get back to kind of being the underdog again, which is where we uh, have the most fun. So it's a good episode. It's a I good season. I said that in the previous I'm, segment. I, this is for people who just tuned in because they found out I was on the radio. That, that's a good point. That's a good <laughs> point. Why don't you shut up? Hey, Mark Paul, that's mm-hmm. your first time like directing? Yeah, it was. Yeah. After yeah. All, all these years. All these years. <laughs> after <laughs> 75 years of business. Oh, oh right. my gosh. Yeah, I should have directed a long time ago. I mean, yeah. it, it's just one of those things that you get to a certain point in your career and you're like, what? why haven't I directed before? Yeah. So I've always wanted to direct and... It was uh, it was a great opportunity to direct an episode that he wrote uh-huh. uh, on a show that we like. So we do, from the business perspective, how does that work? Do you get paid extra as a director? Or yeah, I had like, to join yep. the union. Yeah, you had to join a union. Yeah, yeah, I had to join the DGA. He's in the WGA, so yeah. Okay. As, as if you wear that a different hat, you have to you have to join the union. You have to join a union. So is that something you see in your future? Or? I'd like to. I'd like to continue directing. Okay. Um, I don't know if necessarily doing episodic television is a way I want to go, but it was a good start, and uh, we'll see where it takes me. I will say I, d- I don't like him, but okay. he's a very good director. He, he's a good. He's Brett, a really he, good director. I wish I could say he wasn't. Thank you. You're welcome. All right now, Breck, Breck, and you 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 write obviously. Yeah. Do you do comedy? Does he do comedy? Do I do comedy? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I think most of the stuff I tend to write. I mean, I've been writing. When you on, look uh, the way he does, you have to be <laughs> good at comedy. <laughs> you're, you're Thank you. Thank you. Gonna die. Thank soon. you. Um, <laughs> yeah, I've been doing, like I've, I've been writing this uh, animated show, Robot Chicken, for the last eight years or seven years. I, the stuff I tend to write tends to be comedy. Shit. Yeah, fun stuff like that. What'd oh, you say? Shit. I don't remember asking you a goddamn <laughs> thing. Ooh. Um, Damn, it's getting touchy in here. Touchy gosh. feeling in here. Uh, I'm arming face. myself, Sway. I see you yeah. got that plastic knife right I'm ready there. There we go. I got Heather on my left. Oh, you can you. take your knife I and shove it up you. your ass. <laughs> I got Heather. <laughs> Palms are getting sweaty. Oh, fucking cut you. Clearly, you Ooh. guys get along for better or for worse. But do you have you guys <laughs> learned from each other like anything personally or professionally? How not to act? Oh <laughs> man. <laughs> That's exactly what I was gonna say. <laughs> you was gonna say that I beat you. <laughs> I beat you to it. I beat you to your punchline. Yeah, <laughs> yeah well, I mean, we, you know, we we didn't know each other until we started working on the show. So it's been about a four year relationship, and people ask, well, how did that? How how are you able to get along so well? And I think it's because we both have the same work ethic. We sort of had the same background. We grew up in the industry. We all we both were married at a young age. We we have we have two kids. Uh, we have very similar lifestyles. Um, mine's just a little bit more on the straight. Yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. That and, and sounds weird. Breaking yeah. gay? That, that sounds gay? straight life that sounds gay? weird. No, gay. no, no, no. That's not what I meant at all. Exactly I didn't mean, I, I'm sorry. I didn't yeah. mean to out you. Like I'm you. so <laughs> sorry. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Breaking's gay. It was a really <laughs> quick I didn't mean yeah. to do that. Okay. I came out and went form. back in really quick. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he did just out me, which is weird. Like yeah. a cold and, shower. And, and is a it surprise to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Was it liberating, though? It really does feel liberating now. <laughs> I didn't even realize I was gay. <laughs> so, Until he said it, man. Yep. We'll see what tonight brings. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> we got Adam from Florida on the line. Adams, what's up? Good hey, morning. Hey, Adams. Yo, yo, Team Zach for life, my man. I saw you at Michael Strahan this morning. Just uh, wanted to say what's up, man. Glad to see you doing good, and it's good to see you back with the, with the brown hair. Nothing wrong with Team Brecken, Adam. Why don't you uh, hop on board? <laughs> the brown here. <laughs> yeah, I'll take it out, man. <laughs> <laughs> he likes the brown hair, bro. Dude, you know, people come up to me and they go, what happened to your blonde hair? When did you dye it brown? I go, 
When was my hair? When did it ever look natural and say by the bell? When it was yellow. <laughs> Never. But I thought, Never. That was, I thought that was a Hollywood thing. Yeah. <laughs> How? <laughs> How it's uh, they had like speckled like leopard uh, thing going on where it was like brown and and blonde and. Oh, it was uh, nice. It was like Woodstock. This thing. I keep bumping in this. That's the mic, man. That's the big Damn. mic, bro. We, we got yeah. big mics on shape. <laughs> You're not used to having big things in front of your face. No, like that. I'm really not. Uh, oh man, like, there's so many jokes you could have yeah, gone with that one. Just walk no, away. but the, the hair thing is always a funny topic to me yeah. because it's like you know, I was a kid at a very young age who might have had like a lighter hair. Yeah. And then over the years, it kind of darkened up, like like it normally does, and uh, just had to keep dyeing it for the show because they wanted a blonde-haired kid. So. Yeah. But it never looked natural. I mean, that that thing, it kills me when people say. Yeah, that that you change your hair. That I br- dyed brown, it brown. Brown, yeah. Yeah. So Did anyway. y'all make a lot of money doing that stint? Absolutely not. Nope. No. Well, no. Just was famous for no reason. But you know, the fame <laughs> came afterwards because yeah. we filmed the episode. We filmed the show, and it wasn't until '93 or '94 yeah. when it went into syndication. That's when it took off. Uh-huh. That's when it started oh. generating a whole new uh, bunch of uh, followers. Because our show is canceled every year. Yeah. Every wow. season we were canceled because no one was watching it on Saturday morning. Yeah. Once it became syndicated, that's when people started watching it. Uh, dog, I was watching it. Yeah. Were you watching the original ones? Yeah, I swear yeah. to you. Yeah. Yeah. I was I was Yo, you wonder, were you watching it? <laughs> you got a lot of every, geeks every in here, season. man. No, I think he's too young. You're uh, too young to have watched the original ones. It. He was watching yeah. He was a kid. He was a baby. Haley Mills, watching. right? Yeah. Haley Mills. That's yeah. right. Haley Mills in yeah. the beginning. Yeah. That's, that's right. Yeah, yeah, we were there, bro. We were there with you. Still with you, bro. Courtney in Philly. Good morning. How you doing? Hey, Courtney. Hi. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Courtney, you got something? Courtney, okay? Are you there? Everything all right, Courtney? <laughs> Is he in the house? Courtney. What's going on? Hello, Courtney. All right, gentlemen, now we got you here, man. Uh, of course, Courtney we're talking about down Franklin and Bash, but we do this thing on Sway in the Morning, man, we call the mystery sack. Mystery sack? Yeah. Okay. I, I just wanted to clarify Doesn't, that. And in the mystery sack, the guests have to stick their hands in my sack. Go ahead and reach in. It sways mystery sack on shade forty five. Yo, yo, Brecken. Yo, a, put your hands back. Man. I got a question. Why is Heather holding your sack? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is how it works, Heather. Will you All right, explain? let me break it down. Where can I get a gold sack? I know. <laughs> I wish my, my sack was golden. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, since it's two of you guys here, this is how it's gonna work. Brecken, you're gonna pick three questions out for Mark. Mark, okay. you're gonna pick three questions out for Brecken. You have to read them out loud and answer them honestly. You first, Brecken. Pick okay, one. Here we go. Wait, 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 hold up. So he reads the question to Mark Paul and then... And then and Mark has to answer it. Okay. All yeah. right. You ready? All right. If you had to change... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> if you had to change one body part on yourself, which would it be and why? One body part? I know the answer to that one. Do you really? Yeah. <laughs> I would love for you to tell me. Come on. Is it that obvious? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Those, pan- those body- pants are tight. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? I could take that in so many different ways. That your penis is small. Yeah. <laughs> the pants are tight. My, if I had a big penis, it you'd would make my it. pants tighter. No, you'd see it. Uh, you're wrong. You like right? no, 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 if somebody says your pants are tight, that means you have a big package because it's, it's like it's no, That's right. It, what you I'm saying is <laughs> it, looks, it looks like a Ken doll. No, 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 no. There's no, no, just no. a recess. No, no, no. It's like the Game of like the Game of Thrones. I'm the eunuch. I'm the eunuch. I should wear a robe. They fight a lot. I just don't understand how come you notice that. He's gay. It's He's gay. Because she gets it. That's right. right. She understands. This, okay, this question is for Brecken. Right? Right. Okay. Uh, Mr. Meyer, if you could erase one sexual experience from your memory, <laughs> discluding the night you lost your virginity, which would it be and why? Hmm. If I could get rid of one sexual experience. Wow. I would probably say the virginity one. But you can't. If I can't say that one? Yeah. I, I tried something one time in, <laughs> in, a, in the back of a uh, but her uncle's car. Her uncle wasn't there. Uh, I was with her, but I, I wouldn't do that again. What did I you can't try? Really, what, was it cramped? It, yeah. Yeah. Wait, are you talking about the car? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I was yeah talking about the car. Okay, <laughs> no, it was quite roomy. It was a nice Cadillac. Oh really? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So that's good. That's yeah, fair enough. that's what I would get rid of. All right. This, okay. All right. this is getting juicy. Right? Learned it, it, this, it, we learned about Franklin. Why and Bash. was that bad? It def- what? Why was that bad? I don't want to get into it. Okay. <laughs> 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 if you could have a threesome with anybody, who would you pick and why? A threesome with anybody? Not me. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> threesome with anybody? Who would you pick and why? Uh, Obviously your wife. 
Yeah, my wife and uh, if she had a twin, I don't know. I mean, I was like, oh, that's cute. Bullshit answer. Bullshit. Of applause right there. Save that. Yeah, save that one. You are the whipped man. Good save. Good save. Wow, that is some cool whip right there. Carry on. It, Mr. Meyer, if you could make a condom out of any material other than latex and lambskin, what would it be? Fruit roll up. <laughs> Thank you, roll up. I mean, yummy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Thank you, roll up. They right, make, make those, by the way. Last roll one. They make those. Yeah, yeah, I mean, she's gonna get pregnant, but, <laughs> and maybe with diabetes if it's a fruit roll up. But all right, Mr. Gockler, uh, is that how I say it? Gockler. Sure. Okay. What's the worst place you had to do? <laughs> this is perfect for me. What's the worst place you had to do number two? <laughs> oh, for you. <laughs> 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 the worst place I had to do number two. I'll in, tell you what. Worst, I'll tell you. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. What's the worst place you had to do number two? Mike? Oh, the worst place I had to do number two. You know, I, I, I you know me. Yeah. You, you and I are both the same way. Yeah, I, yeah. We will hold in that number two well, until we are home. Yep, yeah. I will do anything possible to keep that shit inside. <laughs> I mean, that that's like. I, I've traveled halfway across the world <laughs> yeah. and Preach. said, I will not. I'm like doubled over. They're asking, the stewardess is asking yep. me, like, just what's, what's going on? Just keeping that starfish just, together. <laughs> <laughs> just making it home. But I think the worst place I ever did it was in a bathroom, but I, I had a, med I mean, it was a med it was an emergency. <laughs> <laughs> and I rushed into this bathroom in a Del Taco in, yeah. uh, in, uh, Del Taco. <laughs> in <laughs> California. Stock, nice endorsement. just went up. Yeah. I go into the bathroom, <laughs> and then as, I, as I'm as i doing my business, I look underneath the uh, the uh, stall, and I see a woman's feet come in. You're in the wrong damn bathroom. I was bathroom. in the wrong wow. damn bathroom. <laughs> yep. And it was only at one stall, and I'm mm -hmm. like, please leave me alone. <laughs> 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 Please. Uh, we got All one right, more. Mar so yeah, last, last one. one right. It's the last one. It's the last one. Bring it home. Bring it home, Mark Paul. Bring it home. Mr. Meyer. That's a long, that's a long question. That's all right. Like a if a friend came to you asking for advice on how to perform oral sex <laughs> well, what would you say? If it's a guy or a girl. <laughs> if a friend. That's a good question. If a friend came and to what? And, and is he asking for a guy or a girl? <laughs> What's more interesting? What's more interesting? What do you guys want to hear? What's more interesting? I want to hear both. No, you just pick one. Tracy. I just say in general, keep the teeth out of it. I think that's just I think that's worth to live by. I think yes. that's just in general. That's a universal. Just, answer. That's just courteous. If you were raised right, yeah, you just <laughs> leave the teeth out of it. You don't want to put teeth in it. Yeah, you just keep the teeth out of it. Hey man, give it up for these guys, man. I love them. Yeah, man, 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 we learned so much about you guys that <laughs> yeah. we never would have known. Um, but man, honestly, it's an honor to have you on the show. Uh, I appreciate Thank you guys, man. man. Absolutely, Thanks, man. man. Very talented man. Uh, Franklin and Bash season four premiere August thirteenth, ten p.m. on uh, on TNT. Make sure you support and check it. It's Sway in the morning only on Shade Forty Five.